Minnesota's Secretary of State says nearly 1.3 million absentee ballots have been returned to county election offices. That's as of the latest numbers from this morning. Secretary Steve Simon says that means around 128,000 ballots are still floating around. He's urging voters to bring those forms to their election offices before 8 tonight so they count. And before we start seeing some long-awaited candidate matchups take shape, Simon wants all Minnesotans, no matter what, to remember we need to accept the election results. When the last court has issued its last ruling, we are done as Americans and Minnesotans. And we got to come around together and we got to accept the election results if, and especially if, it's not a result that we might personally have wanted to see. As a reminder, if Vice President Kamala Harris wins, Minnesota Governor Tim Walz would take over as Vice President of the United States. Now that could mean Lieutenant Governor Peggy Flanagan may become the first female and Native American Governor of Minnesota. Meanwhile, Senate President Bobby Joe Champion would take Flanagan's place.